They claim to have not been paid for over two months. These are workers of press security company in Kasumbalesa who gathered on Monday morning to protest against the unfair treatment. Those spoken to by Movie TV News have lamented that the delay has affected their livelihoods as some have allegedly been evicted from their houses. We have gone two months without pay. The only, the only payment we received the salary it was on November. Up, this is January. January has elapsed today. No wonder these guys are saying, we'll just hear from management what they will say. Because most of us, most of the guys who have been evicted from the houses, houses they are paying rentals. They have failed to pay rentals. Two, we are working here, we don't receive graduates. The labor is aware. The labor has gone in at the extent of charging the company of not paying the, 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 the employees on time. So we don't know where to go because this is our offices here. This is where we work. But when we ask, ask from the offices, the HR says, no, I will give you a memo. Memo comes saying as soon as possible. So as from November up to now, we haven't been paying salaries. We want the salaries, we want them to tell us when are we going to get getting our gratuities. We want them to tell us now. This is what these people are crying for. They want to work, they want to go for work, but how are they going to travel? How are they going to report for duties when they don't have money? So please, we want the management, we have come in a peaceful way, we have been engaging the management several times in a peaceful manner. But enough is enough, we want these people to be helped. Right now, as I'm saying, in response to the complaint, company security wing manager has admitted the allegations. I think the complaint of uh, employees, they are right, and what we know is we are in kind. December salary and January, which has finished today. Uh, about the team allowances that they are claiming, uh, we, are, we used to pay them the team allowances according to the program which is a dispatch uh, point. Sometimes they get the full uh, mileage, sometimes they don't get the full. They can have half. And when they are on trip, the one in charge of uh, this particular Somalesa used to send them money. And if you don't agree with us, if you were not a good company, you can ask how many areas, how many months of areas do we have? So if areas were like five, six months, on that point, you could say, no, the company is not a good company and it is a difficult company. General Secretary for Professional Private Security Officers Union in Zambia had this to say. Yeah, so our, our union, um, we got in partnership with us, I think, last year, sometime in January, February. So when we came on board, um, they had stayed for about four months without uh, their pay, monthly salary. So when we came on board, we had to um, um, use everything that we could do and they were up to date. But again, for the past three months, they've gone back to the same way and they are finding it difficult to pay their workers. Uh, what we have done, I can share it with you, we inherited this that was a union which was representing the workers. So everybody moved to our union. So now from the time that we started, at least we improved in terms of their monthly pay. Joanne Mwete, reporting for Movie TV News in Lusaka.